In this video, we're going to look at a formula that will return a true or false value um, dependent on whether or not a text string that you're interested in appears in a range of cells. So what we have here is a small list of data just with animals in. Um, so lion, dog, bird, lizard, monkey, cat, turtle. And what we want to do is check if this text string here, cat, in cell C6 appears in this list. And to do that, we can use this COUNTIF formula up here. And this will work in the same way that a normal COUNTIF formula will, except because we've got this more than zero part at the end, it's going to return a true or false value rather than just giving us a count. So what we do is write out equals count if, And then we specify the range of text that we want to check against. So it's all these cells here. And we're just going to lock that as best practice with F4. And then we specify the criteria that we're interested in. So that's going to be this cell here, cell C6 with cat in it. And then we're going to close this off. And then we're going to put more than zero, which will allow us to get a true or false value. Hit enter. And you can see that we get true. And then if we just check this very small list, you can see that cat is there. But then if we were to change this to bat, for example, we'd get false. Um, because bat's not in the list and then dog which is in the list if we were to change it to that uh, we'd get true again um, now the reason this is different to a normal countif function as mentioned is because we've got this more than zero um, part at the end if we were to remove that just delete that and hit enter we'd just get a value of one there for dog uh, and then again if we were to put something that isn't in the list we would get a value of zero. So this just shows how you can use that there to get a nice clear sort of true or false value instead. Thanks for watching this video. If you found it useful, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.